This is Category 5 Technology TV. I'm always encouraged uh, by the, the number of volunteers. I've got one hovering over our shoulder here. Mm -hmm. And uh, people on backstage pass can see. It. Can you get in there? You can kind of see his forehead. Hey, Ty. This is yeah. This is Tyler Steingard. He uh, has done quite a bit of work with us uh, with videography. Uh, you've also done well. We should almost get him on camera for a bit, eh? Maybe we could talk a little bit about uh, about Tyler. Do you mind if we switch off for just a, a couple seconds with Ty? Or what I can do if you turn off your microphone. Mm -hmm. There we go. I'll give you that. And if we can just switch spots for a second. How cool is that, eh? There. Thanks, Chris. There. Hey, Tyler. That saves us having to wire you in for sound. Good afternoon, good evening, good morning, wherever you may be. Wherever you are. Yeah. So Tyler is a bit of a Mac aficionado. When I was experimenting with Linux, he was experimenting with Mac. and So we've both kind of grown into our different uh, operating systems. But you've got interest in Ubuntu as well, eh? Yeah, definitely. I've, I've had a lot of uh, fun in the in the open source world in general, but uh, especially even with, with Ubuntu. Um, I found it to be the most comprehensive distribution of Linux, so it just fits right in. <laughs> just fits right in. Uh, you know, being a, being a bit of a Mac guy, I just I feel like it, it really um, answers a lot of those questions that uh, I had when I, when I was looking at different distributions of Linux. Mm -hmm. um, for various reasons, so yeah. I guess you find that a lot of the commands are similar, being based on Unix and. Oh yeah, I, I just being yeah being really involved in, um, in the Mac platform and it being built on Unix, um, I just really felt a home whenever whenever I'm in uh, Ubuntu and I, I just I I really enjoy actually the shell. There's there's the quote that's going to go up commands. in the blogs tomorrow. Yeah. Tyler Steingard says, "I really felt at home in Ubuntu." Mm -hmm. There you go, yeah. bold letters. Everybody blog about it, tweet about it. There you go. And you know what? Pretty much every day, whenever I'm doing any sort of system administrating on uh, on a lot of the the web servers that I run, they're Ubuntu, mm -hmm. and uh, and so I mean the, I just I love uh, I love Bash. Even even though the GUI is there, I just I do love Bash. Yeah. So you uh, do you play around with the Bosch. server installation? Bosch. Bosch. I say Bosch because I think Bach, but yeah, yeah, you know that works. It, a lot of people then correct me and say, no, it's Bash and Bash. it's Beta. It's Beta, Robbie. <laughs> Why do I get that? Why do I? Get I think that? it's a it's a Bash or Bash because it's born as in uh, B O U R N E. I just can't do it. I don't Bosh, know. Whatever. Bosh. All right. So you've been involved in the show since day one. <clears throat> yeah. Uh, even know, before the there. show began, you were just kind of, you know, uh, getting involved with some videography work. Uh, Tyler was the videographer for the original Jawbone uh, review. Um, that was really your foot in the door with with that, I guess. Eh? And so yeah, I really enjoy new media and and all that it entails. So <clears throat> yeah, whenever I can be available to you to uh, to do any sort of production work or or even Film shooting or whatever. Yeah, there we go. Know? Yeah, I appreciate yeah. that. Uh, what What have you really, you know, with the involvement that you've had with Category Five? What have you noticed about the community, or is there anything in particular that you like about Category Five versus the next RSS feed right. kind of idea? Yeah, no, I, I really like. Uh, I really like the the content is really, you know, I I really love open source, and I just find that the content for um, that community is really really great but Definitely. also the fact yeah. that it's inclusive for um, Windows users and Mac users and yeah good point yeah I just I just find that really uh, really helpful for for it's well-rounded and I cool commend oh, you thanks for that yeah it's really kind of grown into that like I let the show kind of flow with the way that the community makes it flow, right. which has been really cool because for me it started out as just well you were you were he was one of the first viewers yeah isn't that you were watching show one live yeah you yeah. were one of five I was people about that. so that was pretty cool so Tyler was there when I had my webcam and was broadcasting the first ever category 5 technology TV and he probably thought it was pretty silly at that time. I wasn't really sure what to make of it but you know like uh, Robbie's a good guy and, and I've known him for a while and he's helped me out in uh, in lots of different ways in the I'm past. I'm slipping him a fiver under the table yeah you know yeah <laughs> uh, <laughs> Donate now. <laughs> no, but you know, Robbie's been a good guy, and, and um, he's more of an uh, historically an audio head. 
True. And uh, and I just you know wanting to get into new media and 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 that sort of thing. Audio is a big part of that. And and now I see you've really branched out into, into video yeah, extensively yeah. with the uh, with your with your setup. Well, here. you knew me back in the days of radio as well. Yeah. So Tyler was there when I was on the air with radio. So, mm-hmm. but then I don't know. Here I am. Yeah, with your with your web radio station. Yeah, everything. that's true too. I started out with web radio back in 1991. Way wow. back, yeah, and then got when the hired. Web was <clears throat> it was the, real media. When the web was in alpha. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. It was real media at yeah. that time, uh, yeah. like real player, and it was really extremely they low quality. Around? They are, but they aren't. Mm. I, I then we upgraded to G2, the oh, real yeah. player G2. I that. that was a huge deal because it was the closest thing to high quality, mm-hmm. and then everything changed with MP3. Yeah. So, but then with MP3 came thousands and thousands of radio stations and networks like Sky FM and stuff yeah. so it just totally took everyone who was a little guy and just yeah well <laughs> if you're still into mp3 i have just two words for you move on <laughs> <laughs> you an aac guy or what yeah and i mean i'm an aac guy and all right. uh, it's all about it's all about the new codex you know yeah good quality yeah. <laughs> good quality and og og yeah og yeah. open format is yeah. very good yeah just still watching the chat room. Everybody's kind of migrating back down here. Um, so I appreciate your impre- appreciated it, your involvement in the show over the years. And I know, like, just sporadically, you'll come and do videography work for me. He's the one holding the camera. Uh, you also filmed the feature for the uh, defibrillator. Right. Tyler was, was the guy. Fun. Yeah. Yeah. So, just so. shocking, shocking Robbie in the background. You know. That was the behind the scenes video. Yeah. They haven't seen that one yet. So, but you know, just just. Things like that, just being willing to uh, come and volunteer and be a part of the show and, and make it a better a better show has just really meant a lot. So I appreciate that. So thanks for all your help. I, I love to help when I can. Cool. Thanks, buddy. Peace.